We're live. Okay, so pretend this movie is a complete movie. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to make an uh, intro title. In order to do an intro title, you can actually do it right over a piece, right? Or you can have it happen at the beginning of a piece. If you want to do it right over a piece, you simply go to the type tool in your toolbar and click on the screen and type in what you want. Now once I start typing, notice what happens over here. We have this uh, palette that comes down. If you don't find it, let's say you're in uh, effects, right? Uh, go over to graphics and the neat thing about going to graphics is you have your graphics panel with everything you need. So make sure you understand up here that there are a bunch of different tabs and the one that'll serve you best when you're doing this kind of thing is clicking over to the graphics tab. Now under the graphics tab I can do all sorts of things, right? I can select, I can click drag, this is selecting if I click drag over what I've just made and I can do a bunch of things like here, I can go to text down here and I can choose a different uh, typography and other, other things that I can do is I can change the color by going down to appearance. I click here and let's say I want a red title. I can choose that. So there's a bunch of stuff that I can do. I can also change the size. I can change how it's situated. Right now, uh, the, what I've done is there, I can either have it left justified, I can have it center justified, I can have it left justified, there's uh, right justified and then I can click and drag it ever, anywhere I want. If I hold down to the shift key, notice I can't do much in terms of, I, I can grab a corner and I can make it larger if I want. All right, so there I have demo movie. It's not my favorite right now, but it's, it's an okay demonstration. I'm gonna move it to the center. Okay. Now, in terms of moving it to the center, let's say you wanted it perfectly centered and you just didn't want to eyeball it. There are alignment and transform tools right up here, so I can click this one in the middle and it says align vertically. And I can click this one and I can align it horizontally. So once I've done that, I know it's perfectly centered. Now let's say I don't want to have this, uh, play, this demo movie over some imagery. All I have to do is scoot the imagery out of the way. And the way that you select your entire, one way to select your entire movie is to click outside the movie with the selection tool, click over the whole thing, drag it out, and now the demo movie plays by itself. And there's, this is where the movie is. Now, it looks more professional to fade out and then go into the movie. And so the best way to fade out is the way I've been, you've been fading out all along. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to drag in the middle, so I just make this a little bit bigger, so that you guys can see this. And I'm going to zoom in a little bit so that you can see it more. And I'm going to use, again, the pen tool. Click once to hold its place and click a second time to fade out. I'm gonna do the same thing in the beginning because so, I'm gonna to want to fade in. I'm gonna click once to hold this place. So it's gonna fade in, show itself, and then fade out. So this is what that looks like. Okay, all right. So the thing is done at the end, basically, when you need to make other titles, I can move my cursor over to a, like a blank spot at the end of the movie. I go back to my type tool. I type in this place. It Notice it's remembered all the things that I've done. It's remembered my fill color. It's remembered my size. It's remembered my typeface, which is kind of nice. It's a nice advantage so you have some consistency. The first thing you'll want to do is, so you want the name of the movie in the front. You want your name in the back. Usually I'm advocating for two, two titles or a scrolling title. And so I go start by going copyright and then my name and then the date. 
So copyright is the option. You hold on to the option key and the G. Let's try that again. Option key G. That's the copyright symbol. J Bordage. And 2018. Now clearly this is way too big to fit in that space. Right, so I can shrink this down. I can move it and shrink it. Come on. There we go. All right. And I can use these alignment tools if I want to perfectly center them.